What's up guys, Lou here, and I'm excited to announce a new project here on Unbox Therapy. It's called the Ultimate Workstation Project, and as the name implies, this is about building the most outlandish, most powerful workstation computer that we can. We've got an aging Mac Pro over there, and we wanna replace it with something much more powerful, much more configurable, and so we're setting out to do that. And I want your guys' suggestions. I wanna know from you what kind of components you would put in an Ultimate Workstation PC. Everything from memory to hard drives, SSDs, monitors, you know, everything that you would need, keyboard, mouse. I wanna see your build lists. Don't worry about money. Do the most outlandish build list you can, and then we'll obviously edit it down. But this thing is going to be pricey, and it is going to be beastly. So you don't wanna miss out on this project. I've set up a subreddit on Reddit, because that's where you set those up, and the link is down in the description. And if you click through there, you can actually make your suggestions in that location in a more organized fashion and people can vote on your lists, they can vote on your comments and we can figure out what most people wanna see in terms of components. The series is gonna be very similar to the Ultimate Gaming PC so it will be a number of videos outlining not just the process of getting the parts but also building the system and I know you guys really enjoyed that project so I can't wait to get started on this one and then actually implement this new workstation and start to use it and see what it can do in this environment, in our work environment. So anyway guys, if you're a fan of this idea, if you like the idea of a project like this, make sure to leave a thumbs up down below. And as I said before, use the link in the description in order to leave your comments and suggestions so that we can figure out what the best components are for the entire community. Also leave a comment down below if that's a little bit easier, but remember, it's tougher for me to go through those because there's so many of them and they're changing so quickly. So I really would prefer if you guys use the Reddit link instead. Anyways, that pretty much wraps up this video. Thanks as always for watching. I hope you guys are a fan of this project. I think a lot of you will be. And other than that, I'll catch you on the next video. Later, guys.